So um, I've got a I've got a fusion in my back, a spinal fusion from eight years ago, that um, went from T4 to L1, I believe. And last weekend, I felt I was doing next to nothing, but my rods broke. <laughs> I didn't know it at the time. They, um, I was picking up a pot of soup, and I felt a snap in my back. Thought it was a rib popping in or something. I didn't know what it was, but it really scared me. Didn't hurt. I was a bit sore. And um, then the next day, I was helping my daughter put her pants on. She's almost three. And I felt a snap in the other side. And that one didn't hurt either when it happened, but not too much longer later. Not, well... <laughs> Not too much later, and it started getting sore, and it was really, really sore to sleep on, and now I'm just sore. And I went to the doctor, got an x-ray, I was like, what happened? I thought, it's probably just ribs, maybe something happened, so I'll just get an x-ray to be sure, and I get the call the next day, oh, your the rods in your back have fractured both of them <laughs> and i'm just in disbelief stunned i don't know what to do i'm scared i'm thinking what what's safe <laughs> they said that the bones are fine um so my spine is fused now i mean eight years on surely it should be um but i'm just waiting now i'm gonna get a follow-up x-ray next week and i'm just waiting to hear to get an appointment with the specialist and I'm really hoping that it's not something that I have to go back and have surgery for. I wasn't having any pain before this happened and now I just have this funny feeling in my back like itchy, sore, my muscles are spasming all over the place. I'm not sure where the pain is coming from. Is it my muscles? Is it my back? Like the bones? Is it <clears throat> I just have a million questions. I'm afraid to do anything. I don't want to hurt myself. And I feel like I have to give up all the stuff that I was, that I like doing. <laughs> like, I'm like thinking, I'm never going to be able to work in the garden again. <laughs> I don't know. So I'm just videoing this because I don't know if I might put it up on YouTube and see what happens, see if I can share with someone. I tried searching. I can't find anybody on YouTube talking about this happening to them. I can find a few things um, like journals written about research regarding this, and it sounds like I might not have to do anything. If, you know, maybe after two weeks, the pain goes away from the initial shock of what happened, and my body might just kind of adapt to the new whatever. I don't know if there was, if, if my, I mean, my bones have been fused, so I should be in the same position. Um, but I believe the rods just fractured due to stress, cyclic stress, daily movements, little micro movements, and, um, just wearing out the steel and eventually next to nothing will make it go ping. <laughs> and, um, just intriguing that both of them happened within 24 hours of each other but anyway I'll update I'll do another video after I find out some more information <laughs>